Ben Bernie, born Bernard Anzelovitz, was an American jazz violinist, band leader, and radio personality, often introduced as the old maestro. He was noted for his showmanship and memorable bits of snappy dialogue. Biography Bernie was born in Bayonne, New Jersey. By the age of 15 he was teaching violin, but this experience apparently diminished his interest in the violin for a time. He returned to music doing vaudeville, appearing with Phil Baker as Baker and Bernie, but he met with little success until 1922 when he joined his first orchestra. Later, he had his own band, The Lads, seen in the early DeForest Phono film sound short Ben Bernie and All The Lads featuring pianist Oscar Levant. He toured with Morris Chevalier and also toured in Europe. Bernie's orchestra recorded throughout the 1920s and 1930s, Boclean, Brunswick, Columbia, Decca, and Arc. In 1923 Bernie and the Hotel Roosevelt Orchestra recorded Who's Sorry Now. In 1925 Ben Bernie and his orchestra did the first recording of Sweet Georgia Brown. Bernie was the co-composer of this jazz standard, which became the theme song of the Harlem Globetrotters. Radio His musical variety radio shows through the 1930s, usually titled Ben Bernie, The Old Maestro, were hugely successful, with ratings placing him among radio's top 10 programs. He was heard on radio as early as 1923, broadcasting on WJZ and the NBC Blue Network in 1930-31, sponsored by Menon. After a 1931-32 run on CBS, sponsored by Pabst Beer, he was heard Tuesdays on NBC from 1932 to 1935, also with Pabst. His announcer during this period was Jimmy Warlington. On the Blue Network from 1935 to 1937, Bernie's sponsor was the American Can Company. He returned to CBS in 1938, sponsored by U.S. Rubber. With Half and Half Tobacco as a sponsor, he did a musical quiz program of CBS from 1938 to 1940. From 1940-41, Bromo Seltzer was his sponsor on the Blue Network. Wrigley's Gum sponsored the Ben Bernie War Workers Program. He also made guest appearances on other radio shows. He appeared in two feature films Shoot the Works and Stolen Harmony. His theme was It's a Lonesome Old Town and his signature trademark, Yowsa, 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 became a national catchphrase. The term was memorably used by a character in the film They Shoot Horses, Don't They? Announcers for Bernie's programs included Harlow Wilcox, Harry Von Zell and Bob Brown. With comedy from Lou Lehring Fuzzy Night, the lineup of vocalists included Buddy Clark, Little Jackie Heller, Scrappy Lambert, Pat Kennedy. Jane Pickens, Dinah Shaw and Mary Small. To boost ratings, Walter Winchell and Bernie, who were good friends, staged a fake rivalry similar to the comedic conflict between Jack Benny and Fred Allen. This mutually beneficial feud was a running gag on their radio appearances and continued in two films in which they portrayed themselves, Wake Up and Live and Love and Hisses. They are also caricatured in The Warner Brothers. Cartoons The Woods Are Full of Cuckoos as Ben Birdie and Walter Finchell and The Cuckoo Nut Grove as Ben Birdie and Walter Windpipe. Bernie was a Freemason, member of Keystone Lodge 235, New York City. He died from a pulmonary embolism in October 1943, aged 52. Selected Discography